Hey you guys, what is up? Welcome back to my channel. My name is Terika Janice. If you are new here, do not forget to like, comment, and subscribe. I think we definitely should address the elephant in the room. I have been gone for a little bit, like two months. I had been sick for a couple months, but I am feeling much, much better. Thank you for everybody that checked in on me. I appreciate that. And you guys really, really wanted to see more hygiene videos and hygiene shopping. So I thought it would be perfect that the first video that I do would be a hygiene shopping vlog uh to you know kind of get us back in the groove of things we're gonna go to a couple different places um i'm thinking i'm thinking ulta target maybe walmart and um marshall's maybe or tj maxx so yeah y'all that is what i'm thinking i'm super excited um because i need to stock up on a few of my essentials but i also want to see if there's anything new out i'm not going to do too much talking we just really gonna get into it um, I do have my Invisalign in today if I'm talking a little weird, but there will be more videos to come So make sure you guys stay tuned I'm thinking of doing a giveaway and possibly in an upcoming video So make sure that you guys stay tuned for that appreciate everybody that's been rocking with me so far We are just gonna go ahead and hop right on the video All right, you guys, so we are in Ulta right now. The music is hella loud in here, of course. So we are gonna just try to work around it. I wanted to pick up some Murad cleaner. My skin has been like on 10 lately and I need something more than the Fenty cleanser that I use. So I'm thinking Murad just because I've heard a lot of really good things about Murad. So let me know down below if you like it. So they have a couple different products. They have an acne control. I don't really have acne though. So I don't know if I really need this. It's a uh, clarifying cream cleanser. I just have a few like bumps or whatever. So I don't know if this is really gonna be for me. Maybe I'll look at some CeraVe or something like that. But they do have a clarifying peel. I like that. So if you have acne, I would say Murad probably is gonna be good. I heard really, really good things about this. Really helps clear up the skin. They have some toner as well. And um, a couple different products. They also have this Essentials C Cleanser. Let's see what this does. I hope that y'all can hear me in here. Vitamin A, C, E, Energized Cleansing Gel helps improve pollution and other impurities without over drying the skin. Maybe this is what I need because it doesn't say anything about acne. I think this is what I'm gonna go with. This one is, oh baby, that's $42. My eyes was definitely playing tricks on me because I thought that said $12 and I was like, okay, cool, cool. Most definitely says $42, so I think I'm still gonna pick it up though. For $42, it better work. This is what it looks like. Okay, so I also wanted to pick up some glycolic acid because I ran out. I've actually been using the heck out of this glycolic acid for under my arms. I bought it, it had to be months 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 ago but I recently started using it within the past two months and when I tell you I see a major difference in my underarms it, there's no smell they're getting lighter too so I'm like definitely gotta re up and keep using it let's see if we can find it, it was by the ordinary brand I think the last time I got it from here but I'm not seeing I don't know if I may actually have to go to like Sephora because I, I don't see it maybe the girls sold them out so we have hydrogen oil. I did not know that they had hair care though. But this line is very, very affordable, but really effective at the same time. Oh, it's right here, right here. So this is the glycolic acid toning solution. A lot of people use it on their face, but I use it under my arms and it gets rid of the smell. Like literally there's no smell. I don't even use deodorant at nighttime anymore. And it's only $10. So we're gonna pick this up. How are you? Hello, I'm good. How are you? Good. I did want to pick up some of these petty scrubs. TJ Maxx or Marshalls is right next door. So I'm going to go over there because they usually have these for like two bucks. So I'm going to get these because I really, really like these. But they have a couple of different ones. At Ulta, if you want to pay full price, it's $7.99. But I would just go to Marshalls or TJ Maxx. We are in the tree hut section and I'm seeing um, a couple scrubs, two scrubs that I have not tried or smelt, so we are gonna smell them today, so. I already know that I'm not gonna like this, but this is the pumpkin spice, probably not gonna like that, and then this one is coffee. These are the two new ones. All the rest of these I pretty much have. Pumpkin spice latte, it has pumpkin enzymes, nutmeg, kernel oil. Yeah, that definitely smells like, I feel like this kind of smells like hazelnut a little bit, so if you like hazelnut, 
feel like this. It doesn't give me pumpkin spice though, but the color is really, really good. And then we have the velvet coffee scrub. Oh my God. That kind of almost smells like Starbucks a little bit. That's funny. I used to work at Starbucks. I remember coming home smelling like Starbucks coffee every single day. And that's really what that's given. So we're not going to get that. If you guys are not new to my channel, you know that I absolutely love this. I rave about it. This is the Detox in Charcoal Underarm Bar. It just helps to detoxify your underarms. And with me trying to lighten my underarms, I think this is just going to be perfect. It makes my underarms smell super fresh. And then pairing it with the glycolic acid, I think it's just going to be the perfect match. So I'm going to pick this up. And this is $8. I also wanted to show y'all the Osea, Osea, I think it's Os Osea, I don't know, something like that, Osea. Now let me say this, they are very, very pricey, $48, but they did actually send me over their body oil. It kind of comes in a bottle like this, but it's an oil version. When I tell you it has my skin feeling so, so soft, so if you are trying to splurge a little bit, I would say picking up the oil to this is so good. They have a salt body scrub, this is the body balm but yeah i'm sure this is really really good all of the other products that i have tried from them i'm gonna show y'all when i get home but all of the other products that i've tried from them have been really really good i did also want to pick up some more bubble baths i've been super into bubble baths lately and i've used pretty much all of my dr till's bubble bath i wonder if i should get it here though or target because they are seven dollars here and then i'm not sure how much they are at target i'm sure they probably a little bit cheaper at target so I may just pick that up at Target. Okay, you guys, so I actually did find the body oil. This is $48, so it is a bit pricey, but in my opinion, it is worth it. My skin feels so soft, so glowy, but I have this. Um, I don't. I have the body butter too. This smells really good, but I have not tried it yet, so I'm gonna let y'all know and keep y'all updated on how I feel about this, but this, 10 out of 10. If you're ready, she can get you right here. All right, y'all. I don't know who in their right mind would come vlogging on a Saturday, um, but we moved. So I'm looking for, so basically right now I'm in Marshalls and I just wanted to see if they had any of the petty scrub. I just wanted to see um, what they had. So yes, oh my goodness, how cute are these clips right here? Little clock clips, those are really cute, the colors. Love that, how much is this? I don't need this y'all, but I might get it. How much is it, $6? I don't need it, but we gonna get it. And they have these like cute little scrunchies. Like how cute is that? I don't need this either, but so cute. Six dollars. These are like really good um, stocking stuffers, I would say. So I am gonna go look for the petty scrubs. That's what I'm trying to find. Let's check it out. Oh, they have a little dry brush. I do already have a dry brush at home, but this one is a smaller one. Let me see. This little mini dry, oh my God. I'm gonna break a nail messing around with these folks in Marshalls. This one is a little mini one, which I think would be perfect for under my arms, just because I have a bigger one and it actually is a little bit hard to kind of dry brush under my arms with that one. So I think I'm gonna get this little mini one. This is so cute and it's only $4.99. Y'all, I'm so glad that I came in here because I wanted to pick up some razors. They are usually, I think like $7 at Walmart and Target. So I'm gonna pick these up because they are $4.99. Now this is just a three blade razor. I've tried the five blade razors. They just don't work for me. I feel like I get more hair bumps when I use the five blade razors. I don't know, I could be tripping, but see I told y'all Marshalls be coming through. They be having these. These are the petty scrubs. If y'all remember, they was $7.99 at Ulta. Let's see how much these is. So this is a four in one cleanses, exfoliates, moisturizes, massages, and it will last up to 20 washes. But I don't see the price on here nowhere. See, that's how they get you. Let's see if this one. Oh, see, okay, it's $3.99 here versus there. It was a $7.99, so definitely a good deal. This one has shea butter and tea tree oil, so I think I'm gonna get this just because I feel like it'll be a little bit more moisturizing. I also wanted to grab a new foot file because my other one is done for it and it's smaller, so I wanted to pick up something a little bit bigger and that's gonna last a little bit longer. So I'm just gonna get this like black one just to help you keep your feet soft throughout pedicures. Honestly, these days I don't even get pedicures no more. I just do my own feet at home. 
but this is $3.99 so I'm gonna pick this one up. I have been seeing a few people say that they had Dr. Jard in TJ Maxx and Marshalls but I finally found one. This is the Firming Collagen one so I think I'm actually gonna pick this up because it is $8. I'm gonna pick this up. I'm so glad I came across this. This is a clay calming mask. They have a firming solution, clearing solution. Oh, this one's a brightening one. Oh, I love this. I have some discoloration on my face. So I think I'm gonna pick this up. It's $8.99. No, I don't. No, thank you. Okay, you guys so all of the girlies have been talking about the Frenchie Frenchie I think which I've seen before um, but I don't know if I'm really ready to try that yet but they do have a citrus amber and I think this cashmere vanilla I smelt on one of my other vlogs and I thought it smelled really good they have a couple of different scents and I've heard a lot of really good stuff about the line so I think I may pick it up I go shopping again okay so I most definitely need to get me a new exfoliating washcloth you guys know i live by these i wanted to get some bubble baths so we are in target oh i'm so glad because y'all know in um ulta i think they were like seven dollars it's 5.89 here so i'm super glad that i waited this is the one that i really really love this is the himalayan salt it has essential oils in it and epsom salt i am out of the myel rosemary mint scalp and hair oil strengthening oil i like my hair definitely love this so I'm gonna pick some more of this up my cousin really convinced me to pick this up so I think I'm finally gonna pick it up it actually does smell really really good it doesn't smell strictly like coffee it actually gives me like a vanilla -y type of smell let's smell it again though oh my god yeah this actually smells really good so I think I'm gonna get this I think I'm also gonna pick this up though this has to be my favorite OGX body wash because it smells so good it has like this light fresh clean coconut scent shoot I was just about to say I needed to get some razors but I forgot I was able to find some razors at um, Marshall looks like Dove has some more body wash this is the antibacterial one a soothing care one. Oh my god y'all this smells so good oh my god I gotta get it realistically I don't need this but we're gonna pick it up anyway Alright you guys, so we are back at the house. I picked up a ton of stuff. So I wanna go ahead and share it with you guys. So make sure if you have not already, give this video a thumbs up and subscribe down below. I'm gonna start with Ulta since that's where I went first. I went ahead and picked up some Tula skincare. This is their cult classic cleanser and it is powered with superfoods that remove dirt, impurities, makeup, and all of that jazz without stripping the skin. I've never tried this before, but I've heard a lot of really, really good things about the Tula skincare line. It has probiotics, superfoods, and also it is cruelty free and all that jazz. I wanna smell it to see, to see what it's smelling like. Okay, it actually smells kind of like a baby wash, almost like, um, what's the baby wash? What's the, the brand? I don't even, I can't even think of it, but it smells like a really nice, like baby wash. Has a really, really good smell. I really love the smell of this. So I picked that up. I went ahead and picked up some, I'm not quite out of my glycolic acid toner yet, but I am running out. So I wanted to go ahead and pick it up. If you guys remember in like one of my very first hygiene hauls. I picked up the glycolic acid by the ordinary brand. I see a lot of people use this on their face. I'm sure it'll help like kind of even out your skin tone and stuff like that. So I probably will use it on my face too, especially uh, since I do have some discoloration around my mouth area. It has 7% glycolic acid. So I use it for my underarms. And when I tell you there is no scent daytime nighttime i'm putting on deodorant because i want to make sure i smell good even when you know i'm just going to bed and waking up and showering in the morning i still want to make sure that i put on um deodorant because you know sometimes you still can get a little 
sweaty throughout the night and stuff like that and you can t start to smell you won't smell as fresh but what I've been doing lately is taking some of this glycolic acid and putting it out of my arms and when I tell you there's literally no smell no smell it's so crazy and it completely eliminates the scent from under my arms and I really love it and also another difference that I've seen is it actually is lightening up my underarms which that's something that I've been working on for a while so I've actually been pairing this with some of like the other like natural lightening agents like turmeric and stuff like that and I have already seen a major difference under my arms so far and I've been using this for probably about a month and a half I'm telling you guys I would highly recommend adding this to your regimen when I get out the shower I put this on before I put on my deodorant and my deodorant just lasts longer it smells fresh for hours I really would recommend this and I really really do live by this stuff and I really I'm telling you like it will eliminate odor and then if you are also taking like chlorophyll drops and stuff like that like it, you literally probably don't even have to wear deodorant that's how good this stuff is so I picked this up from Ulta. Another thing that I picked up is this detoxifying underarm bar. This is something that I don't personally think that you absolutely need. It really does detoxify my arms clean and remove all the deodorant and the debris and dirt. So I really love this. Um, and this also has glycolic acid in it, which makes sense because glycolic acid really helps to eliminate the odor under your arms. So, um, I'm here for this. I really love this. That is all that I picked up from Ulta. I think I spent around $50 there because y'all know Ulta is expensive. Y'all know how it goes. We are going to move on to Marshalls. Y'all know me. I don't like to wait in that line, especially because today is Saturday and everybody and their mama was at Marshalls today, okay? So... Um, I did wait it out and honestly the line went super fast. They had a ton of workers so I wasn't it didn't bother me too much. So I got quite a bit of stuff. First thing I wanted to show you guys was this little dry brush. I do have a bigger one which this one I believe I got it on Amazon but this one is perfect because I actually have been dry brushing under my arms as well like it'll be a perfect fit like since it's not too big but dry brushing I absolutely love doing it. It helps your skin out so much. It exfoliates your skin um, but it also helps with lymphatic drainage and stuff like that too so um, I think it's just an overall great technique. Didn't necessarily need it just because the other one, it does the job, but I just did just want to get this just for convenience. You can use this all over your body, of course, but I'm probably going to mainly focus it on like my underarms and like those hard to reach areas. I think that was $4.99 and then I got this, just this simple black foot file. This was $3.99. I think this is something that every person needs, boy, girl, you know, anybody, just because you know, it just is going to help to keep your feet soft in between pedicures if you still get pedicures. Because honestly, I don't know really the last time I had a pedicure. I have not had a pedicure in a while because I take care of my own feet. And plus, I don't like how people do my toes. So, I'd rather do my own. I probably won't be going to get my toes done unless I'm, you know, just trying to relax and have a pamper day or something like that. I'm going to stick to my foot file, my pumice stones, my moisturizers, you know, all that jazz to keep my feet nice and soft. But this is perfect and I think this is something that everybody needs. Kind of to go along with the foot care, I got one of these petty scrubs, which I think I actually have another one um, now that I think about it. It's in my drawer. But this is a 4-in-1 cleanser, so it cleanses, exfoliates, and um, moisturizes, and also massages your feet at the same time. It's perfect for your feet, so that way you don't have to use your towel on your feet, um, which, honestly, I don't have an issue with, as long as that's, like, the last step in my routine, um, is washing my feet. I don't have a problem washing it with a towel, but I would prefer, like, something like this. You can use it up to 20 times. This one has shea butter and tea tree in it. So this is how it looks. Now this was $3.99. As you guys seen earlier in the video, at Ulta they were $7.99. So definitely check out TJ Maxx or Marshalls before you go and spend $7 on this. Because honestly, I don't think it's worth $7. So I think it's worth the $3.99 that I got it for. So pick that up. I did pick up some more skincare. I picked up some of these Cryo, Cairo, something like that. A mask so this one is a brightening one and then this is a firming collagen one so this these this is how it looks I'm so excited to try them out these were only eight dollars and ninety nine cent I'm really excited about the collagen one just because collagen is really good for elasticity 
um, and aging and just have so many great benefits. And then with the vitamin C, it's just gonna help me brighten. So I got that. I was also lucky enough to find some razors for the low. Um, this was $4.99. Like I was telling y'all in the store, um, I prefer these ones. These ones have been the ones that I've used like forever, for years and years. I did try to switch up and use like a five blade razor and stuff like that. I find that, especially when I use it under my arms, the five blade razors, I got hair bumps. I hadn't ever struggled with that before. I just think that these just work a little bit better for me. I'm just gonna go back to these and I'm happy that I was able to find these. I also got these little cute little clips. Like how cute are these? Such cute colors. You have like a little blush one. This is like, um, a kind of nude one, a black one. Like these are really, really cute. I really love these. And I think I ended up spending like $40 at Marshall's. And then last, but certainly not least, Target. I picked up one of my favorite things on earth, which is the Eco Tools um, washcloth. This is essential in my routine, pretty long enough so I can get my back, wash my back and really make sure that my back is being exfoliated. I think these are only about $3. They last about a month, but I just think it's perfect for your overall body, helping your skin stay smooth and soft and all of that stuff. So really love that, pick that up. I did end up picking up a few body washes. Um, so I finally picked up this coffee scrub. It actually smells really, really good. Um, the coffee is not too overpairing. The coconut is not too overpairing. I think it's just like a perfect blend and it's pretty affordable too. The thing I really love about these um, OGX scrub and wash is that you don't have to worry about if you are on like a budget or something like that, you don't have to worry about getting a scrub and getting a body wash. Or if you're just lazy like me sometimes, I don't feel like exfoliating and then doing my body wash. I'd rather have it all in one. I went ahead and picked up the Coconut Miracle Oil Body Wash by OGX. This smells so good. Has to be one of my favorite OGX um, body washes and honestly one of my favorite body washes. So this smells really good. It has like a really light coconutty type of smell and it just, I don't know. Mm, it just makes me feel so good when I use it. I love that. And then I also picked up this antibacterial soap from Dove. I mainly got it because it smells really, really good, but it's also an antibacterial. So it's gonna help fight off that bad bacteria. And so I'm really excited to try this and it also helps protect from your skin from dryness. I also picked up some more bubble baths. Recently been using up a lot of my product and the bubble baths have been one of the things that I've used up. So I said, let me go ahead and pick this on up here. Um, I think this is this was like $4 and then at Ulta is like $7. I'm like, y'all tripping. So I'm happy that I waited and picked this up at Target, but this is just the Himalayan. What is this? Pink Himalayan. Makes really great bubbles. It smells good. Love this. So I went ahead and got this Sure Cool Dove Dry Spray. It smells really good, really fresh, clean. Also just picked up some floss and then I picked up some hair care. So this is the Rosemary Mint Scalp and Hair Strengthening Oil. I picked this up a while back too. And I really love how it makes my hair feel, smell. My scalp is really um, stimulated when I use this. And you can use this daily as a scalp treatment. You can also use it on your split ends. And this is by My Oil Organics. I actually picked this up the other day. This is a purifying detox body wash by Dove. I just showed y'all about four or five body washes by now and um, I know y'all sick of me. At this point, I'm sick of me too. This is one of the newer ones. It's Purifying Detox. It has green clay in it. Smells really good. It honestly puts me in mind of the cucumber one almost. Hope that you guys enjoyed this video. Again, if you have not already, hit up on that like button, subscribe, leave a comment down below. I'm so excited to be back. I'm so excited to be back, y'all. I'll see you guys in the next video.